So um, you just like relax them and then you bang, 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 you hit them with a, hit them with a big question. So I hammer and keep hammering until I get a result. Mm. Mr. Quinlan Ballistics confirmed that the gun Liam used in the bottle shop this morning is the same gun used to kill a young security guard in armoured vehicle robbery 12 months ago. How do you respond to that? Hmm? Liam says he found the gun in your safe. But can you explain that? He's lying. This man, Jared Harding, was convicted. Was convicted for that armoured vehicle robbery. Now he's doing four years. Four years in Long Bay. He was your client, wasn't he? No. Jared Harding, your client, shot and killed a young security guard during that robbery. But we've never been able to find a weapon, but now we have. Am I under investigation here? If we can tie this weapon and Jared Harding, we can get him for murder. Did he hand you the weapon to look after? No, he didn't. You know as well as I that I wouldn't knowingly be in possession of an illegal weapon. He handed me an envelope. But the gun was in it, wasn't it? I've no idea what was in it. What do you think was in it? Can open it? So when you opened the safe, was the gun just sitting there in plain view? Uh, no, it was in an envelope. Right. And was the envelope open or sealed? It was sealed. I had to tear it open. And could you tell just by looking at the envelope what was inside? I mean, by the weight and the size, for example. Uh, yeah, it was, it was just a thin manila envelope. Okay. Mr Quinlan, if you can tell us that Jared Harding handed you this gun, we can nail him for murder. If you don't, we can't help your son. We can't. Well, you've got to think about it. Jared Harding gave me an envelope under privilege. Jared Harding? Jared Harding shot dead. A security guard who has two little kids at point blank range. Now, this is the kind of man, this is the kind of man that Liam, your son, is going to be living with for the next three years of his life. Unless you decide to help him. Jared Harding did not give me a gun, he gave me an envelope. Hey, okay, it's just a precaution. Don't worry about a thing. I remember. I think he had short, dark hair and was about my height. Sure. Yep. I'm gonna find this guy. Rick Daniels was hit by a gold Mercedes. This wasn't hit and run. Gavin's after him. So what's Daniels' connection to Christy Adams? Don't know. I'll get on to taxi company. Someone may have picked him up after he dumped the car. Yeah, hi. Yeah, listen, I want round-the-clock guard on Irina Nedov and Rick Daniels' rooms, okay? No visitors. No one goes in or out without security. Right? Thanks. Sir, I want more officers. We need to set up a task force. Yes. The Mercedes definitely hit Rick Daniels. We've matched cloth fibres from the bumper to his clothing. What's Rick Daniels' connection with Christie? He's been an ongoing sponsor of uh, Frank Willis's training squad since before the Atlanta Olympics. Did he harm her in any way? Maybe he didn't need to. Maybe Gavin just needs to think he did. Christie Adams. She fails, she commits suicide. Gavin drives a car into Rick Daniels. He fails to kill him. He tries to finish off the job in hospital. Irene gets in the way. He moves on and kills Frank Wallace. So who's going to be next? You better find out. When was this? Have you got an address? Thank you. Taxi driver picked up a fare late last night near the car park, took him to the old waterboard buildings.
This entire area is sealed off. Let's get Carly down here. Get him to bring his whole team down here. Okay, Jeff. I want you to speak to anybody that was in the area. Okay, residents, factory workers, whoever. Right, somebody must have seen Gavin. Gavin's got a mobile. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Subscriber checks, call charge records, right? He's got a phone, right? Check it out. Eddie, he's a cleaner at the hospital. Yeah, Gavin works inside the hospital. I want to increase security on Rick Daniels and Irina Nettle's rooms, okay? Yeah, Irina Nettle. Well, if he thinks that she can identify him, she's in danger, isn't she? Uniforms are on the way. Increased security on Irina Nedov and Rick Daniels. Nobody goes in. Okay, nobody. I'll get onto it. I just lost my father. And um, I give anything, like anything at all, just to, just to have another day with him. I can't change that. You can. We're going to need a full, unambiguous statement that Jared Harding gave you the gun. And Liam doesn't do jail time? I can't promise that. You're a barrister. You know the law. But Liam, Liam's still going to have to go in front of a judge. Do you want Jared Harding or not? We can give Liam a letter of assistance advising the presiding judge that he cooperated with this investigation. It carries a lot of weight. Ball's in your court, Mr Quinlan.